German defense minister named the year when war between Russia and NATO could begin. German defense minister Boris Pistorius predicted when Russia would attack NATO. This is known from the build material. Pistorius presented his plans for a new military service in Germany, in Berlin. He attributed the need to a different threatening situation than a few years ago. The minister clarified that we are talking about the war being waged by Russian President Vladimir Putin against Ukraine. He called for the assumption that as early as 2029, Kremlin troops could attack NATO. We must also restore deterrence among personnel, Pistorius stressed. In Germany, they are going to increase the number of armed forces from 181 to 203,000 people. In addition, according to NATO and Bundeswehr estimates, the army needs approximately 200,000 more reservists. The military wants to recruit the most qualified, the most motivated. The implementation of the new plan is expected to cost Germany 1.4 billion euros. The allocation of this amount must be voted on in the 2025 budget. Let us remind you that in Germany they plan to send out questionnaires to 18-year-old boys and girls, from which 40,000 will then be selected and sent to military training. In particular, it is noted that after 13 years of the country's refusal to compulsory military service, the head of the German Ministry of Defense presented the idea of recruiting soldiers again. According to all international military experts, it should be assumed that Russia will be able to carry out a military attack on a NATO state or a neighboring state from 2029, Pistorius commented on his decision. Earlier, Boris Pistorius said that Russia continues to accumulate resources to start a war in Europe and Georgia and Moldova is under greatest threat. A massive fire broke out at the asphalt storage facility of an oil refinery located in Erbil, northern Iraq. Due to the massiveness of the blaze, around a dozen firefighting teams tried to put it out. The cause of the fire remains unclear. According to Al Maluma website, 12 civil defense forces were injured in the blaze Erbil-based Ruda New Agency has also reported the injury of several people in a large out-of-control fire at oil refinery fire. Rudaw Media Outlet learned that several other refineries are located in the vicinity of the burning refinery. An eyewitness told Rudaw that one person was injured and many others suffered from breathing problems but Rudaw could not independently verify the information. I was close to the refinery. When I heard the sound of the explosion, here was a big bang, he said. Fire incidents are common in Iraq and the Kurdistan region. A fire broke out at an asphalt factory near Arbat town in the east of Soleimani in October, killing one worker and injuring three others.